on another bus stop fishing video only this time we're not actually going to be doing any fishing today we're heading off to Trago Mills in Merthyr Tidville now that's a big sort of warehouse type of a shop department store and they have by all accounts a very good fishing section and prices are very low so we're going to go over and check that out it's going to take about two hours to get there first bus out of Newport is the 30 to Cardiff then we have about a five or six minute walk down to the next bus stop which is a T4 and that's the Trans Wales um, bus and that goes from Cardiff all the way up to Newtown and stops off at Merthyr Tidville and also um, Brecon so we're going to shoot down to Cardiff change over to T4 We'll be using the T4 in another fishing video later this year because the T4 is a buzz that goes to the Clannon uh, Reservoir and that's a big uh, trout fishery run by Welsh Water. So we'll be going over there sometime later this year. But this one's just a trip out to um, Merthyr Tidville, have a wander around uh, Trago Mills and we'll just have a look at the prices and the sort of selection they have there. Uh, on this bus stop fishing video, which is actually just a shopping video. to the Trago Mills now we just need to find the fishing department and we'll have a look at the fishing gear I think over here we've got a small selection of Rapala lures and hooks and price wise they're not too bad I think they're about the same sort of price as you'll find them on Amazon it's about £15 for a, a lure, but that's for a parlour, so, you know, that's not too bad for a parlour. You know, we've got carp spirit hooks, but anything with carp wrote on, you're going to be paying over the odds for. Um, suppliers for carp anglers do like to uh, boost the price but we have loads of different pop-ups feed flavor additives and the like and over here as well hemp pellets pop-ups prices aren't too bad a fiver for six mil 4.79 for rubbing red Carp pellets. The so price wise is, is, is quite good. Spicy shrimp and prawn, could do some of those. Those are about six pounds. So let's have a look. We're right next to the camping section, so that's handy. Uh, get some nice bows and arrows if you want to do that. Right, Shakespeare's salt. 
water of reels. £40 for the 40 FD. That's not a bad price. The 20 FD is 34 Come up to large atlas are pre spooled, spin 70s. 16 pound multipliers 30. Got the Firebirds, those are around 15. And we've got some uh, fly fishing gear there. Right, now this is what I'm after. I'm after some uh, some hooks. Tronics. So we've got some rigs made up. There, two rigs. One ninety nine. Hooks. This is a. I wish I brought my glasses with me now. Size six. Six hooks. One ninety nine. Uh, I need some swivels, snap swivels is what I want. Let's have a look at those. So size 2, 179, so we'll take those. Uh, three way swivels, don't really, I'm not really into three way swivels, let's look for some two way swivels. I do wish I'd got my glasses. Actually, let's swap out those. For size nine, size one swivels, one seventy nine, and I'll have some of those. Uh, four, I don't know, one seventy nine. I'm looking for some hooks. Size one hooks, base holder hooks, so long shank, one ninety nine. Size one for ten. We'll give those a try. So I'm still looking for two way swimmers. Um, so you've got all the rigs made up here and about £1.50 to £1.99 per rig for sea fishing. So this is two up one down, sea rig. Uh, that's another four hook. 149, so that's okay, that's not, not bad. Um, I'm trying to find these two way swivels or connectors. So I've wandered around. So we've got leader lines around £3. Leader lines, uh, fly fishing line, flies, and stuff. This is what I want to get at some stage is magnet holder. That's at three nineteen. That's quite good. Floats. A set of floats there. Two ninety nine. They're more very basic floats. You haven't got anything quite nice. This is forty nine. Float rings. I want to buy this gorger. And these are quite nice legs. Two fifty nine for those. Good selection. Um, don't you have any? Uh, this is what I'm looking for. Rolling swivels twenty. We got twenty for ninety nine p. That's okay. That large marker floats. It's not as big a selection as I thought they'd be. Eight buckets are forty pound. Or thirty seven. Um, but as I say, it's not as big a selection as I thought they'd be, but not too bad really. So you're talking thirteen pounds for a unhooking mat. Trouble is with hooking back some things like that. If you in a car, that's fine. You can take as much as you like. But if you want the buzz, weight matters. Now that's a rod holder. And Abigail says soft 
I'm a holder for rod holder for 20 pounds. This is a smaller model of chair that I've got. I've got the deluxe version. This is just a stool version. And that's at 25, 26 pounds. You got a much more substantial chair for 42, but you can't hop them on the back, so it's quite limited that way. Uh, four rod quiver bags, 20 pounds. Carp reels. Have a look at these carp reels. These are king carp, and they're around the 25, 15 pounds, 30 pounds. So what's this? It's a carp carryall, £17. As I say, anything with carp in it will cost you twice as much as uh, about it. Some nice gloves. Non slip, three finger, around £9, £8, £9. So that's not too bad. Now these are what I'm looking for. Look at this. These are very expensive for beads. Two pound. Some of the soft baits are quite quite expensive. But uh, this is a carp section. So you pay double for carp. Some Mitchell reels, Nabagossi reels. This is all off, £20. It's not bad for a £20 reel. Actually, a surf. £30 for a surf. 6000 I think the Fladdens are their home own brand. And they've got Fladdens coming in at around £15, £20. Looking quite good. So the Vantage, this is how much, okay £5, uh, breaking strain, uh, £3, at what's the length, 160 metre, or just under 160 metre. You got bulk line, trilene. Oh, nice, isn't it? Trilines are quite good. We make those on the seven eight pound. Got leader lines, maximus leader lines, triple hooks, triple hooks. Vantage. I think Vantage is the main line to do here. Uh, King car. Uh, so leader lines again, leader lines. We've got a few Abergas here. Lures and spinners. What's the spinners cost the spinner? It's three ninety nine for small spinners. Six ninety nine for five spoons. That's oh, okay. I'm noting. Thirteen ninety nine for three laws. I've noticed they don't have any of the uh, jointed laws here. Yeah. Um, so three just basic laws that you'll get. I've been looking for a disgorger, but I haven't seen any disgorgers. So these are little ones for snowbee. Snowbee are quite a good basic. Um, I mean one ninety nine. 199. They're quite good for basic, but nothing special. Uh, so we've got power base. Let's see what this is. This is nine pound. So you've got one head and two tails. Nine pound, one head, two tails. Chip uh, logs. Some Palatrax hooks. Price wise isn't too bad. 
and you've got some other tracks. Bikes, clothing bikes, pop ups and like. The least sort of ride I go for, I'll go for a. Uh, what's this? This is a real combo for £21. For a good, good start. Huh? Um, you've got a 30 to 50 gram law rate. And it comes with a real, so it's a good start. You've got uh, the pinks and the blues, kids stuff. If you see rigs, salt water shakes with salt water rules. You know, they, these are very expensive, the beads are. You can get much better quality beads and cheaper beads if you look in the jewellery making section of a craft shop. You can get some quite nice glittery beads. Uh, for half the price, and you can get about 150 for two pounds. So, got some of these. Let's try this. Let's try one of these. You got one, two, three, four, five jelly worms for one pound fifty. So, we'll give that a try. Take those. I'm not going to take any laws at the moment. But well, I can't believe I can't find a disgorger. Maybe we've got some uh, adult tangles. What's that? I mean, that's what? Eight pounds for three paddle tangles. So, we'll try one of days. Fillet your knife. All I've got to do is catch a fish first, which I don't have a great deal of uh, experience of. I have a lot of experience of pushing the uh, reels out, but uh, nothing can be back. Fladden. So getting fladden is a basic thing and you're getting what a pound is that? One pound nine pence for single laws. You got fladden. Those are quite nice. Got all their hooks and stuff. 69p for size three swivels. Not too much of I've got those. Let's go and swap those out. Let's give the flattens a go. Let's try these. Size 1 swivels for 99p. Got plenty of hooks, but I've got hooks. Got uh, some luminous pre hooked. Let's try those. No, I don't use those for less size six. Quite large. We'll see what happens with these. More flazens. This is 89. Actually, shall we go with those instead? Let's go with those. Let's try those. That's uh, 89p. Do we have anywhere where that's working? Well, we'll have a look at those when we get back. Two ninety nine. Um, so I've got quite a good selection of feathers and stuff. Actually, we might try those. Yeah, let's try those instead because I'm going to come back um, and I'll try those next time. But let's take those instead. Right, that's that section. Let's go around to next. Okay, nothing up there. Uh, we've got the rods down here. Now, these are rods aren't any good for me. They look quite good. Could do, this is 67 for a pen. Prevail 2, 67 pounds. I only go for telescopic rods. Because obviously carrying them under buzz means I need rods that can compact down quite small and go to my bag. Um, but you've got some nice beginner rods here, two sections. 
to well if I took these then I would it's two section rods but then I'd have to buy a case for it then I'd have to carry my backpack and a fishing rod case and get in and out of buzzies it's just not easy so I'd much rather go over telescopic stuff and it all goes down into my backpack so £11 for telescopic I might come back for one of these Next time I come back, I'll make sure I've got uh, a good wad of cash with me. Because I'd probably go for one of these. But the one thing that I haven't found are disgorgers. So, what have we got a pair? No. No. Oh, well. No disgorgers, but... I've got a handful of stuff, so I'm happy. We'll go out and uh, buy this up. Definitely worth coming down. Prices aren't too bad. They're about the price that you'd pay for a man Amazon. Uh, it's certainly cheaper than in uh, normal fishing shops. So let's have one quick walk around, see if we can find a disgorger, and then we can uh, pay up go for a coffee and then head back what's that oh there we go we've got a disgorger I'd have not liked a nicer one than that 69p but uh, having one is better than having none I do like those weights. They're not really the sea fishing, but for, should be okay for history. Two men beefy, £200. Unhooking mats, £17. And bags, £60. Alright, that's it. A good walk round, highly recommended, and now I'm going off to pay. Well, that was an interesting couple of hours I spent down at Trago Mills. I stopped down for a cup of coffee, uh, waited for the bus to take me back to Murfield, Kidville bus station, and the bus back to Cardiff and into Newport. So, number 23 from the Murfield bus station drops you off right outside Trago Mills runs every 20 minutes so quite a regular service but let's have a quick look at what we managed to buy so 149 we managed to get these 20 centimeter jelly baits uh, they come with um, hooks and they've got uh, barbs on the shank to hold the uh, the bait in place. Um, be interested to see how they go on the Lyosk uh, in estuary fishing. That's one pound forty-nine for five. Okay, we've got seventeen centimetre and in an old. Uh, let's try and find where those are. Okay, that's. I do wish I had my glasses. So, disgorger, disgorger was sixty-nine pence. I had hoped that they'd have a lot better selection of good disgorgers. The selection wasn't as big as I expected it to be, but there was quite a lot there plenty uh, of the basics there need the bigger selection of disgorgers uh, lots of um, pop-ups bait food uh, mixes scents like that so quite nice Abu Garcia reels and Shakespeare reels laws weren't too bad so what's our next one is five pack Okay, Gummy Max. Gummy Mac. 
that comes ready hooked. So you just tie your line on to the swivel. I think size size six hooks. So those are luminous as well. So those came in at one ninety nine for five. That's not a bad deal for luminous lures. So then we've got the barrel swivels. Basic pladden barrel swivels. 79 pence for eight. Eight of those size ones, 79 pence. That's okay. Nothing to complain about there. Safety snaps. So we've got safety snaps. One pound seventy nine for nine. Nine in there, one pound seventy nine. And they're a size size one zero. So I have to I normally buy these in bulk and they didn't have any bulk packs. So I mean I normally buy these at a hundred at a time and they last me forever. But we'll give them a try. So safety snaps. Then the hooks. One zero hooks, ten, ten of them, and they cost me one ninety nine. So that's about twenty pence each. That's quite a lot for uh, one zero hooks for, for what I pay, but uh, they're not the part. So we'll give those a try. They're long shanks, which I, I like, and we'll see how those work with some baits. So and finally, the last one we bought was the casting snaps. These were 179, 15 of them, and they were size 4. So that's okay, I mean, total wise, it came to uh, 14, £20.53. £20.53 for all of it. So, no, no, it wasn't £20.53, £10.53. £10.53. I bought some trousers while I was there, you could buy anything, and I very nearly bought a ukulele. One of those shops that has loads of stuff. It's got a big uh, soft play centre as well, so if you bring the kids, it really can be a day out. Restaurant prices are actually quite good. Fish and chips, bushy peas, uh, freshly cooked to order, £6.50. So, worth coming up for a day if you want to spend a day here. Um, coming up from Card Newport and above, it took me just over two hours 20. Uh, two hours 20 back uh, and not too bad I think next time I'll come up with a bit more money with me uh, so we can buy a lot more stuff when I get landing net I'll have a look, let's look at those rods and there's some stuff in the camping section I'll have a look at and they've also got the regatta uh, Mac in the pack yeah, there's small fold off waterproof Max for £17 I want to have a look at those but now that's for next time after pay day but overall quite a good day today highly recommended coming up if you want to do some general shopping it's probably not a destination location for fishing but if you're up here anyway they've got a good selection of fishing gear on and very good prices so that's it for today like subscribe and share if you enjoy this video so that's bus stop fishing number three shopping at Merthyr Dinville at Trago Wells.